This tutorial demonstrates how to add audio to your Hippo Animator movies. In this example we will work with two MP3 sounds, a short beep, and a longer jazz loop. Use the import button on the library to import sounds. Audio is notoriously difficult to work with in HTML. Mobile phone web browsers are especially hard to work with. The best supported technique for playing sounds is to use buttons. Add a new button to the library. Change the text to beep and open the onclick script event. Add a new function, sound play. The first parameter of the function is the name of the sound, beep. The second parameter is a true or false value for loop, set this to false. Add the button to the movie and press play to test it. Export the movie to HTML. In Internet Explorer 9 or above, HTML5 is used. Allow JavaScript and the movie will run as expected. Some other web browsers have problems running MP3 sounds, or don't support audio at all. When this happens, Adobe Flash is used instead. Here we show the same page in Firefox. Some Flash features get blocked by default on your PC, so the first time you run a web browser that requires Flash, you will need to change the Flash security settings. This won't be a problem when you run the page on the Internet. Click the Settings button on the Adobe Flash Security Warning. Choose the Advanced tab and scroll down to Trusted Location Settings. Add the Hippo Export folder, or to save time, just add the whole C drive. From now on you can use Flash in any exported movie. Refresh the web page. Using buttons to play sounds will work on most web browsers and mobile phones. Another way to use sounds in Hippo Animator is to add the sound directly to the timeline. Here, we drag the jazz loop straight into a layer. This is nice and easy to do, but it won't work in mobile phones. On mobile phones a user interaction, such as a button press, is required to play any sounds. Delete the jazz loop from the timeline and select the button we created in the library. In the onclick script, change the name of the sound in the sound play function to jazz loop and set the loop parameter to true. Change the button's text to start. the jazz loop starts playing when you press the button. What we want to do now is make the jazz loop play as background music. Add a function to the button, go to and stop, set the frame to 1. Add a new frame to the button, add time 1. Turn off visible in the frames properties. Add frame 1, add any shape, or control you like to the movie. Here we added a rounded box. Now, when you press play and click the start button, the jazz loop will play as background music and the round box is shown. This is how to add background music on mobile devices. We can improve this on desktop browsers by hiding the start button if sounds can be started automatically. In the movie properties, Add some script to either the general script, or the unstart script. If, can, auto play. Go to and stop 1. And finally add, sound play jazz loop, setting loop to true. Now, when you play the movie the rounded box will be shown, and the jazz loop will play in the background. However, on mobile devices the user will press the start button to see this.